What's going on boys? Welcome back to the channel. Today we about to go over the best defense in Madden 23 post patch. Drop a thumbs up on the video. Hit that red subscribe button. Y'all killed the video yesterday. Appreciate all of y'all. Make sure that y'all get the ebook so y'all can never struggle in Madden 23 again. Let's get into some shout out. We got a shout out for Battle. Thanks for being a part of the Nodi Squad. We also got a shout out for M. If you want a shout out, all you got to do, make sure that you are subscribed to the channel. Comment down below. Let's get into today's Madden 23 post patch defense. B -b -b Banger! All right, so starting off on the defensive side, we are in my nickel over scheme. Full ebook is down below in the description. It has about 12 to 13 different blitzes, lockdown defense, and you're going to be able to win more games guaranteed. Nickel over. I am in the Chiefs defensive playbook. Now, the patch did hurt a lot of dime defenses and the 335 loop. Other than that, my nickel over is dominating, okay? I also have an offensive scheme that will be updated tomorrow. Now, like I said, I like to come right here. I like to do auto base line. I like to come down here to zone coverage. I like to do match. Some people was asking me about how do I do my quick adjustments and audible super, super fast. We're going to have cover four quarters right here. We're also going to have cover three buzz seam. We're going to have over storm brave. And then right here, you can do whatever you want to. Put any defense that you feel like works for you. Cover three hard flat. We can put that right there. We're going to come out in our cover four. That's our base defense. Cover four quarters. Some people was having trouble with slants. So I'm going to show you how you use her with slants concepts. Okay. I'm also going to put some video clips in from yesterday and earlier today to show you post patch that everything that I am telling you 100% works. And if you really, really want to get super, super sweaty, make sure that you get the ebook down below. You can win money in the CFMs or you can just dominate against your friends. All right. So right here, we're going to pick some slants. OK, so singles, doubles, slants. OK, so like I said, what I'm going to do, I'm going to be an auto base align. I'm just going to pinch my defense. That's right D pad to the right and then down on the left stick. Pinch your defense, okay? D-pad to the right is going to bring up your linebackers, okay? YY or triangle triangle is going to bring up all your secondary. Somebody said, how do you make adjustments so fast? Go into practice mode. YY triangle triangle is going to bring up your icons. You can do a lot of things just by clicking a button, putting him into a deep half, putting him into an inside third, go to your cornerback. You can go ahead, put him into a soft squat, hard flat, outside third. It's a lot of different things that you can do if you learn your quick adjustments. All right, so my base defense, I like to pinch my linebackers. I like to bring them down one or two steps. But if they're not running the ball at all, I won't even worry about bringing them down one or two steps. We're going to say that they are doing a slant, okay? Not sure who they have on slants, but I'm going to show you this is how I'm going to use her. So if they are doing slants, I'm going to come down and I'm going to play these routes right here, left or right, and I'm going to watch what the quarterback does, okay? I'm going to stay underneath the routes and I'm going to watch what the quarterback does at the same time. The quarterback, the way that he is leading lets you know what way he may or may not throw the ball, okay? More than likely, if your quarterback is leaning to the right, if he's slowly moving to the right, that's more than likely a route that he's looking to throw it to. If he's moving to the left a little bit out of the pocket, he's more than likely going to throw the ball to the left. Now, if he throws it cross body, it's going to be a good chance with a little bit of pressure that is going to be an inaccurate throw or an interception. So if we look at this right here, I'm going to come down a couple steps. That's just how you play Madden, and that helps with your pass rush. Okay, that right there is enough to take the attention of the center. Boom, he turns toward me. I come down. Go back out. Now it makes it so he can't get 
in a double team animation. Now I'm gonna come under these ropes. I see the slant right here, and I'm gonna run just enough till the pressure gets to the quarterback. Okay, so at the same time, I'm gonna set up my full ebook defense. Boom, we're gonna come down here, pinch. We're gonna bring these dudes down a couple steps. We all set up. We're gonna guess pass if it's a third down or a fourth down. Okay, so right here, we're gonna go ahead and put slants by him put him into a route now they're gonna have slants across the field okay so slants across the field if that's what you're having trouble with we're gonna take advantage of that I'm gonna show you how I'm gonna use her and I'm gonna have my ebook defense set up so I can make sure that the pressure is coming so I'm gonna be holding the LB or L1 that's something that I do it helps my user out so I'm gonna hold L1 LB come down come down a couple steps come right here boom I'm gonna take these routes and then the pressure should be getting to the quarterback watch the quarterback's eyes out of your peripheral at the same time watch your routes okay so here we go right here I'm gonna come down a couple steps LB L1 is gonna help the computer take control of you now I'm gonna run back out okay I'm looking for these routes right here okay who is he gonna throw it to the pressure is getting to the quarterback boom now in this situation he can just force the ball if you want to, but I have guys over here that I can click on and try to get an animation, or right here, I can click on and get an animation. Okay, so let's set up the defense again. So if we pinch the linebackers and we set our defense up, bring them down a couple steps, it's super fast. Anybody with more questions, make sure you get the ebook so you can get the Discord. Ask me a question anytime throughout the day, and I try to answer every comment on the video. Okay, so we're gonna do slants, put him like this. We have our defense all set up. Boom, he's gonna hike the ball. We're gonna have pressure coming in, and before slants can even get open, that's exactly how my ebook defense is set up. I'm gonna be able to generate pressure super, super fast. All right, so when he hikes the ball, we're gonna come down here. We're gonna play these routes, okay? Slant is taken advantage of. Now, everything that I showed you in the video yesterday, I will pin in the comment section. Now, my base defense, I'm gonna pinch my linebackers. I'm gonna bring these guys down a couple steps right here. Not too many, bring them down a couple steps. Get these guys close in the box right here. At any given time, I might blitz both of these guys. Boom. If I see that they are leaking the running back out. So if they hitting the running back on a route kind of like this, coming out the backfield or anything like that, I'm going to blitz both of my linebackers so I can generate a lot of pressure. Sometimes I will even be aggressive. Take him away. They try to hit the running back coming out the backfield. I'm going to be right there. Boom. If you try to hit the running back, I'm going to come straight over here. Blitz them, blitz them, blitz them. Okay. We will go more into defensive coverages behind on the next video but make sure that y'all stay tuned i appreciate all the love and support i want to go over how to use quick adjustments how to lock up slants that i've been having questions on now a full scheme i'm telling you is in the ebook it's on sale you need to take advantage of that right now Thank you.